I mentioned at the top of the interview that Matt Taven and Roosh were announced for the Bullet Club Beach Party as well. They are Ring of Honor stars, and for a while, it looked like that New Japan Ring of Honor relationship might have died down or maybe went away altogether, but we're seeing a lot of the stars kind of cross over again. Does that surprise you? Did you think that that relationship had reached its end, or is this just business as usual to you? No, no. Um, I think uh, that relationship will always be uh, will always be there. Uh, I think a lot of um, what's happened uh, is due to the two companies, the office side of things. Because as wrestlers, we all work together. Ring of Honor guys, we we all work work well together. So for them to be coming and being part of this uh, beach party makes it even bigger. Did you think that by now, or, or even at all, there would be a New Japan All Elite Wrestling relationship considering the ingredients involved? Or do you think that the departure of some of those people are maybe the reason that didn't happen? Uh, there's a lot of uh, uh, behind-the-scenes stuff with the office. Uh, all I know is the relationships are uh, okay with all the wrestlers. I'm not sure what what the company between New Japan and All Elite, um, that kind of dealings is going on. I'm not sure what's happening there. So um, maybe maybe that's the reason. But uh, I think at the same time, you know, the relationship between the, the office and the wrestlers might have been a little rocky 